Welcome back to another weapon build video and today we're going to take a look at the sepulchrum and my builds. Now I thought I explained this in my Trumna video and how to get these weapons and the necrolisk and it seems like this person and other people might not even understand how to get this weapon and I literally explained it in the video. So I'm going to break it down for you guys the easiest and the possible way that I can explain this and how to get this weapon. So you go to your navigation, you go to Deimos, that is located next to Mars, which is on Mars now, and you go to the Necrolis. Click on Necrolis, go to Fast Travel, hint Fast Travel, and go to the Father, and he has all the weapons there, even this one. Hope I explained that very well to you guys. So, that out of the way, Let's take a look at these weapon stats. 30% critical chance, critical multiplier is 2.2, fire rate is 3.67, magazine is 90, reload speed 4.0, terrible. Status chance, 14%, uh, so this is looking very, very good. Uh, critical chance is amazing, critical multiplier is decent, status is looking pretty nice as well. Base damage, impact is 9.6, puncture is 26.9, slash is 11.5, so not bad. Now this weapon has a second fire mode, burst. Critical chance is 38%, critical multiplier is 3.0, fire rate 1.00, yup, same. Status is 26%, base damage, impact, punch, impact is 19.2, puncture is 53.8, slash is 23.0. And it has a radio tag, which has heat on it. This is all based on heat. So, this is honestly looking really good. Like, I actually really like this weapon. Honestly, I might like this weapon more than the Athodai. Which, crazily, has more stats and does more damage, honestly. But, I gotta say, Spe Sepulacrum is one of my top second, I guess... Favorite weapons now. I thought that is going to be third. So let's jump right into the builds. Here's my first build. This is my setup. That was terrible how I did that. <laughs> so level 150 corrupted heavy gunners. We're going to spawn in three. Just to show you the amazing damage this weapon does. I gotta jump over these guys. I cannot be shooting at the bottom. Ooh. Crazy damage you see right here. Hate when they moving. And you're out. My accuracy really does suck, but I hope your accuracy is really better than mine, because that is going to be better for you to do more damage on these guys. Next build is a viral build. Here's my setup. Amazing damage. So I gotta say, um, not bad for a viral build because this definitely took me a while to get this build um, looking very good. And really good for you guys because I really do try to make these builds and I'm trying the best I can to build the best way possible that I can. And, you know, this one took me a very long time, but it did amazing, as you can saw, or as you saw there. And I got to say, it, it was really, really doing good damage. So, you know, I tried with these builds. So, last, this is a gas build. This only works on Corpus. So, remember that.
We're gonna spawn in three as well. Love the gas build. It's even taking out these, uh... Yeah, them. So that was really good. And I didn't even show you guys the viral build. So let's switch back real quick and show you guys that. Wow. That took him out very, very quickly. So that did amazing. It literally just two shots, two shots to take him out. That did amazing. That was really good. So, like I was saying about the gas build, gas builds work good. As long as the weapon is good, the gas build will work good now i know you guys are complaining about the gas bill how it's so trash but and i know it got nerfed and it's i think it really just depends on the weapon like the weapon has to be really good it has to have a really good base damage a really good crit base damage and how much red crit is doing and all this and i know you guys look for that you guys really strive for that to get that red crit build and honestly i think it's just how the weapon is based on you know what i'm saying so really i think it just depends on the weapon how good it is but if you guys enjoy these three builds make sure you comment down below if you didn't please don't so i forgot to show you guys the secondary fire mode and honestly i'm glad because the secondary fire mode really does not work out it's not very strong and it does not work on these enemies. It really just doesn't do a lot of damage. So, I mean, it just doesn't do a lot of damage. But I can show you guys if you do want to see it. So, just really, just you, all you have to do is just build up this meter right here. That bar, that green bar you see. If you have any color for the weapon, you'll see what I'm talking about. But all you have to do is build that up. And this will lock on to targets. As you can see, those white things... They're locking on the targets, and it's going to ready. Once you're ready to shoot it, shoot it. There you go. Targets are hit, and it's supposed to do a lot of damage. But for this build, it does not. And any other builds, it does not also. So really, I just, you know, uh, I'm kind of upset because I thought this was going to do a lot of damage, but it wasn't. Especially for the second fire mode, it has a lot of crit base. And it just doesn't do good damage. So that's that's pretty crazy to me. Pretty crazy to me. But if you guys enjoy these video, uh, not enjoy the video, but if you enjoy these three builds, make sure, please make sure you comment down below. Because I think these builds are pretty amazing. Especially if the secondary fire, secondary fire mode does not work. Still, I love it. I love these builds. But anyways, that's the end of this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you hit that like button. And make sure you subscribe if you're new to the channel. We're on the road to 500 subscribers. So please, do me a favor and hit that sub button. I will not let you guys down. If you want to see what's in the next video, make sure you comment down below. And I'll try to make the video any way I can possible for you guys. Because I know... You guys are looking for some good videos, so definitely. Ooh, that did good. So, that's the end. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. You guys can always hit me up. Thank you for watching. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.